In today's video, we are going to be exploring the forward extension of the left hand. If you have watched my video on the backwards extension, you may already be familiar with some of the um, the basic principles of um, extensions. I'm posting the link below, so if you if you haven't watched it and if you're interested, uh, that might be um, might be a good place to start. But as a as a quick recap, the only um, the only finger we ever extend away from the others is our first finger. So whether that is backwards or forwards, so we never extend between any of the other fingers. It's only in the neck position. So that's only our first finger that does that. So that means obviously that our second finger, the third finger and the fourth finger and the thumb always stay together as a unit. And that is really, really important when we now start looking at how to do the forward extension. So let's get started. And I'm going to demonstrate it on the G string. We start, as per usual, preparing our whole hand. That's really important. Never just fish for a note, always prepare the whole hand, the whole position. So I do that. I take all the other ones off and I stay on my first finger, A. Now, that finger stays there. You need to imagine that that is either drilled into the fingerboard, super glued to the fingerboard, that does not move. The fingertip does not move. The only thing that does move in the first instance is our thumb which will probably by this point be opposite your second finger. Now the thumb steps forward and by doing that, because remember these are a unit, it takes the second, third and fourth finger with it. So our first finger is still on A. Look what happens next. My thumb steps forward and it creates this nice big gap here. And there is our forward extension. So very, very important. Never try to do that without moving the thumb because it simply won't work. So initiate your extension. The thumb. And if you do that, that will automatically take your other fingers forward and your fingers will be landing hopefully perfectly in tune. If you have any questions about this, please post them in the comment section below and I'll be happy to answer them. And if you thought this video was helpful to you, um, hit that like button, subscribe to my channel and I would be really happy to see you again soon.